The last day of the festivities in Newport, Sunday ending with champions being crowned. It was final Sunday at the Tennis Hall of Fame with the singles and doubles championship matches on the schedule. We begin with the showdown of training buddies. Three seed Alex Mickelson taking on two seed Marcos Giron. Friendly competition between guys who actually practice together. Californians, the 19 year old Mickelson with a winner at the net here. He takes the first set 7-6 in a tie break. But the experienced Giron striking back. The winner on the return to the corner here. He take the second set 6-3 and Giron fighting off a championship point from Mickelson to rally in the third. He had 13 aces on his serve two including one on his own champion point. He wins the match. Marcos Giron, the 2024 Infosys Tennis Hall of Fame Open singles champion. 6-7, 6-3, 5 It's his first title on the ATP Tour. It's amazing. It's it's tough because holding the trophy is just the, the last part, but I, you know, I think it's just a culmination of a lot of work throughout the years. It's the first time on tour playing a week without losing and so to be down match points and come out with some great tennis is, is an incredible feeling. Newport has been wonderful to me and uh, it's, I've really enjoyed my time here on and off the court. Everyone's is super friendly. It's a, such a beautiful city and so I've, I've really enjoyed it. First title about to turn 31. Congratulations to him. Earlier in the day, the doubles championship match on center court, and it's the team of Andre Gorenson and Sem Verbeek taking down the American duo of Robert Cash and James Tracy, the reigning NCAA champs, in straight sets 6-3, 6-4. So that's it for the tennis in Newport this week. Thanks to Don Coyne on the outs for all his help with the video this week. Remember, next year, the revamped event comes to town. Men and women will compete at the Hall of Fame next summer. Looking forward to it.